morning, good morning everyone, good morning. Good morning guys, good morning, how are you doing, what are you up to? We're just jumping in the car, because we are off somewhere that we can actually tell you about now. So we're just getting a, um, getting some works done on the garage at the moment. If you can see all the vans and everything, I'll tell you about that another time in another vlog getting something very very exciting built in the garage um garage 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 so on the amazing. garage garage okay if you could it's like a sauna we're wearing hoodies on the hot on a hot day it's not good if you saw yesterday's vlog you will know what we're wearing if you didn't see yesterday's vlog then you're probably thinking what the heck are you wearing then go check out yesterday's vlog we are off to go and photograph for a little photo shoot of Zoe wearing all of the new clothing. What, what? Well, that I can't look at you because I've got to concentrate on the road. Marcus, as in Marcus Butler, has a music management company that he's owned for, I don't know, like the last year he's been working secretly behind the scenes on it. And one of the artists has just released a new song called Maisie Peters. The song's not called Maisie Peters. She's called Maisie Peters. And this is it. I'm going to leave a link down below to it. You need to go check it out. It's called Place We Were Made. I've already been listening to this like all morning. It's so cute, isn't it? It's so cute. I feel like it would be the perfect song for an autumn lookbook. Yeah, just like a summer drive. Put your, we should have gone in the mini with the roof down. Oh. Playing poker down in a shed, talking about boys. Now we call X freezing cold. Friday nights and fires on the beach. These stairs are steep. You need to start working out. So do I. Have I told my vlog what we're doing? Did I tell you guys what we're doing? I don't know if I told you. We're currently off for a photo shoot for Zoe. <laughs> Shoot location number two. Oh, I nearly walked into the wall because it's all glass. Zoe and I are heading off to do something very exciting. The others are staying for lunch in there. We've just finished shooting. All of Zoe wearing wearing the new merch. I've got out all my best poses. Yeah? Yeah. Right, now we're heading back to the car. and I'll explain when we get to where we're going. I, I can't explain it. You'll have, to, you'll have to see it to understand what I'm about to say. So we've just arrived at the destination after driving for blooming ages trying to find it. We couldn't find the car park. We went to two car parks that weren't the right ones. So I don't know how persuaded Zoe to come and do this with me. You didn't really. You just mm. said, oh, and then after we've taken photos, we're going to that. that no, thing. I told you ages. I also told Poppy, told Poppy and Sean, this has been booked in my diary for four months ago. My PA found out this was happening and she was like, this is so something Alfie wants to do. And she booked it in the diary. Poppy and Sean are at V Festival at the moment, so they couldn't make it today. But, oh, they've got toilets there as well, because I really need the toilet. But they, um, I mean, but we're currently speak to? at the world's longest inflatable assault course. Is that right? Yeah. Assault course? Obstacle, obstacle course? course? Obstacle course. Something like that. The world's longest. So this is like ridiculous. I don't know what to expect, but Zoe and I are here to just, to have a go. So it's down by the race course in Brighton. Look at it, guys. It is so blooming big. And you think the stuff that I buy for our garden is big? Look at this. I give you way too many ideas. Yeah. You get off here, oh, yeah. it's totally up to you guys. Awesome. Thank you so much, you know, man. You're welcome, Mom. We'll catch you soon. Should we leave our shoes at the, at the exit? So this is where we finish off. So we're going to leave our shoes here. <laughs> I can't believe I've managed to get Zoe to do this. What side do you want, left or right? Um, I want this side. Yeah, you want left. Are we actually racing? No, let's help each Be other. Be careful of the water. Let's help each other. Right. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. This is the first obstacle. Okay. Three, two, one. Mind the water okay. there. Oh my god. Do you know what? It's like out of the way. Come on, you got this. You got this. You got this, Zoe. Oh my god. Zoe's already scared at number one. Oh my god, Alfie, I Are you gonna jump? No, you have to stand up and jump. Are you serious? Yeah. Okay, hold that. I'll film you and then pass Alfie, your camera down. I can't it. Alfie, I can't. Remember, like, you have to land on your bum. So jump onto your bum. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't do 
Go on, you got this. Oh my god, I can't. It's really soft. I'll be so I proud of you. you. I want a backflip or front flip. Are you serious? You ready? Yeah. Shall I just fall? How do you not know? That's ready? gonna hurt. Go on then. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> Go on, you got this, Zoe, you got this. <laughs> Come on! Yeah, go on, you got that. But onto your bum, not onto your feet. Yeah! Oh my god. I hope it's not as hard as that the whole way round. Honestly, I just... Are you ready? No, you have to walk along here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, so it's like this bit's easy. No. Up here, like this. No, surely not. Yeah, of course. It's an obstacle course. This camera. Oh. Ow. Oh no, oh no, the trick is to run. <laughs> oh my god! How are we gonna do this? Oh my god, I nearly fell off the back. Whoa. Who's going first? Three, two, one. Yes. Yes, Zoe. Go on, you got that. No, no, no. Three, two, one. Hey! Be careful, it's really high up. One leg on each or two? two I think mean, do it how I did it. Oh my god, help me! <laughs> Oh my god, you did it! Whoa. Out of the way! Going down! Oh. I just put my foot in the biggest pile of water. <laughs> yeah, it's soaked. Okay. Let's go. Next bit. Oh. oh no. You can do like these. This is cool. Oh. <laughs> I can do like these. Yeah, I'm gonna go, just go for it. Go on then. Oh, look at that. See, it's because you're so light and nimble, like I told you. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Oh shit. Okay, now I understand why you fell. Oh my god, this is so sick. No way. Should we race on this bit? Okay. Three, two, one, oh, three! Oh, that's quite steep. Three, two, one. I'm too big. <laughs> Ow! Oh my god, there's water everywhere. Oh! <laughs> Zoe, look at my legs. There was water all in that, like a puddle on purpose. Dive through it. Try and jump through. I mean... <laughs> Guys, I'm knackered. I'm knackered. Oh my god, what is this shit? I'm knackered. You got this. My feet are you got this. Oh, no. My camera. Your camera. It's really wet. Will you take it? Living the luxury life at the top of the castle with the peasants trying to climb up. Go on, you got this. Oh. You got this. Yeah. My feet. Look at my feet. Same. So wet. Woo! 
Right, here we go. You have to try and get over where it is. Oh, it's a <laughs> you have to try and jump over everyone, okay? As in, as in you have to go over. Okay. No, you can touch it, but you have to go over. You can't get over the second one. You can't do that one. Oh. <laughs> no. I got it. You technically did it! Oh, it's so big. I got this. You're gonna run through the curly poo? Yeah. Three, two, one, go! I don't know what is on the other side of here. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Jump no, onto your back. No. Go on, you got I this. Can. You do it. I'm gonna go down and round. No, you're gonna jump on this. No. Hang on, I'm gonna sit down. I don't know how puffy it is. Yeah, I know. Oh well. I'll learn. You'll literally bounce back off, gorgeous. Gonna You're gonna go flying. <laughs> wait there, wait there. I'm coming. <laughs> the second to last obstacle. And then the big slide. You ready? Yeah. Woo. Oh my gosh. Oh no, my feet. My feet are so wet. You got this, gorgeous. I don't know what Zoe's gonna do when she gets to the top. She's gonna be so scared. Time to start climbing with one hand, one vlog camera. Careful. One hand, one vlog camera. Your boy is climbing. I feel like I'm making it to the top of Mount Everest. Okay, are you ready? We'll go down together at the same time. Look at what we've just accomplished. I'm actually knackered. It's so wet at the bottom. Just go and race it. Are we going down at the same time? Yeah. Let's both do it and hold hands together. Are we not like super close now? Yeah. Oh my god, Alfie. Woo! So high up. Let's not link in case one of us falls away. Three. I'm going to get so wet, can we go more to the middle? I can't. Look at that wet pile. Three. No, 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 not link like this. Oh my god, Alfie, this is so high up. Three. Two. two one. <laughs> oh! oh my! <laughs> My legs! Look at the water! Oh my god! My bum! Do you know what? This oh would my be gosh. so good on a really hot day. It is pretty hot, we just yeah. weren't prepared. Yeah. And there's only two of us. If there was like ten of us doing this, bloody hell. Oh so my bum fun. is like soaked. Same. It's a good job when we're in black. <laughs> Alright. We did it. Oh my god. Oh, the last thing I want to do is put my shoes on. I'm so gutted, I literally bought and charged up and everything, my little drone to be able to shoot some shots of all of the stuff. But I um, bought two wires with me, two little cords. Both of them aren't for iPhones, the iPhone one is at home. So I can't connect the controller to my iPhone to fly it. Ah! Do you know what you could do instead? What? Put me on your shoulders. And just run along with you holding my camera up in the air. Yeah. 
I could just try and throw my camera up in the air. Anyways, didn't get drone shots. Still had an absolutely savage time. It is so here it is. until Sunday. If you want to have a go, obviously this isn't sponsored. Um, if you want to have a go, it's called the Labyrinth Challenge and they travel it around the UK. Ages 12 and up. Ages 12 and up. I asked because I was like, surely kids can't go on this. Like, this mm. is quite terrifying. Yeah, it's pretty like. <laughs> they have kids stuff. It's pretty though. extreme. Like, some of the stuff is, is blooming. It's hardcore. I'm so happy that I did that. I, I that came down that 40 foot slide. 40 foot slide. I've got a wet ass. I've got a time. very wet ass as well. And Kevin, right. We've got leather seats. Should we head back? Yeah. I need we to eat some lunch. Seat on and then our... Yeah, we can dry out our bums. We I'm need so to, hungry. We need to eat some lunch I because we left the others in an amazing restaurant it's and we really didn't we didn't get any food. I know. Leaving a restaurant when I'm so hungry and I love the restaurant to go. But then and imagine do it, if we had eaten course. before we did that. Oh, if oh we had like God. eaten loads of like chips and like burger or no. salad or whatever. I would not have liked that. Yeah. It is eleven minutes until everyone finds out about the pop up shop. Just heading into the office now. Here's the thing, it's a few hours later now, everyone's left the office except for me. Zoe is at home editing a vlog, and I'm kind of looking at the place, and I don't feel that it should be set up like this. I feel like these desks should be in that part, and this table should be in this part, and then we either get another desk over there, or bring one of the sofas over there. I feel like basically the place needs to tidy up. I feel like it also needs a jig around. I don't know if I can jig it all around and move it around by myself because the weight of that middle table is ridiculous. So if I try and move that by myself, I feel like I'm either going to break my back or I'm just going to scratch all the floor by dragging it. My other thought is that I don't move the furniture around, I just simply tidy everywhere for now because everywhere could do with a very good tidy. I've got all like filming lights out that shouldn't be out. I've got a random plant pot on the side. I've got all deliveries that have come recently. More stuff that like samples for merchandise and things. My drone laying on the floor. A steamer to steam all the clothes for the photo shoots just on the side. Like picture things and oh these are these are really cool. So anything you buy from from the pop-up shop if you buy anything at all, you will get given a free PB sticker and a free Sug Life sticker in your bag. We've got a thousand of these and a thousand of these. So be blooming quick if you want one. And then we've got new merchandise here. We've got tons of samples and stuff for future merchandise there. We've got loads of table tent bats on the side. Plugs and charges and bottles of water. We've got a blooming bin on the floor. We've got a plant here, but with no plant pot. That's just like a plastic plant pot that you get. Like that's not a proper, not a proper plant pot. We've got a plant pot thing here upside down. We've got these on the side. I don't know. It's not like, it's not like crazy messy, but it's not how the office should be. And upstairs is definitely not how the office should be. I kind of need to proper finish organizing that so that I can get filming gaming videos up there and pointless blog videos up there. But what I might do, I might just have a good spritz. I feel like I should just whip round, tidy everything for like half an hour or an hour or so and then, and then head back home. It is a worldwide known fact that this table here is the heaviest table in existence. And I want to move it. And you know what I'm like. When I tell myself I'm going to do something, there is nothing that is going to stop me doing that thing. My aim today, right now, this second, is to move this table from here to here. I've got two little ripped up bits of foam under the table legs, and I'm going to attempt to drag this table into there. I don't know if it's going to work or not, but we can give it a go. Here we go. Right. Ugh, bloody hell. Yeah! Yeah, I am not going to be able to walk for three days after that. It looks awful. I now need to rearrange everything. I cannot believe how much we've just achieved by myself. Like, this is looking sick. I kind of got these designed to go above the table. So they're pretty low, so what I'm going to have to do is get an electrician to come and shorten them. But for now, I might just wrap all of this up and put a little, like, 
elastic band around it just to make them. Let me take one of these and put that around it up there. Let's see what we got in here. Oh yeah, we've got a little table, I forgot about that. It looks like someone's pooed on the floor, but I actually dropped a plant. A couple of vlogs ago, maybe like a week or two ago, I filled this with office furniture of mine. This sofa, that sofa, the table, the rugs on the floor, this little thing, this little thing. I kind of never put it back into my office. So I need to put this stuff back into my office, but I also don't have too much room now because since this stuff left, we hired a new member of the team. So, we added, we added a desk. We no longer have space. There's bloody spider on my leg. Get off. We no longer... No, it's on my other leg. Get up. We no longer have space for the sofas. I don't even think we have space for one sofa anymore. I've measured the length of the sofas very efficiently with my arms. And I'm currently attempting to carry one of the carpets, the rugs. So this is where I'd love my sofa. And if I remember correctly, it was about this much longer than this. That literally could be perfect. That could be perfect. Or I could carry my sofa all the way up here and it's just not perfect. Do I try and carry the sofa up by myself? This may just be a bit too heavy for me. Oh my god, I feel a bit lightheaded. I've managed to get it here. I need to get it in there. I might just have a, a little lie down for a minute. I think I just broke my back. Take two. If I didn't vlog it, did it even happen? Did it even happen? <laughs> I've gone delusional. I'm gonna have to, I have to try and fit this through this door. I mean, it'd help if I opened it. Through this door, without chipping all the paint off the walls and breaking the place. If this doesn't fit here. Oh, I've only gone and got the bloody thing stuck. Oh no. When in doubt, have another sip of water. And try again. If you can't do it after a second sip of water. Oh, can I have a sip? We'll take a third. Give, you you give your girlfriend you another one. Yet? High five. We did it. Yeah! And we're done. We're done, guys. And that is it for the vlog. I was absolutely frazzled. I was dead yesterday after doing all of that. By my, except from the sofa. Zoe helped me get the sofa through the door, but all of the carrying, all of the moving the table, all of moving the desks, all of tidying up, the blooming blow up challenge that Zoe and I did. I was dead yesterday and forgot to end my vlog. I think I fell asleep at something like 10 o'clock. Like the last vlog clip in this video was filmed at 9.30. And then I just came home, fell asleep. So if you enjoyed the video, if you enjoyed the vlog, Go down below, give it a thumbs up. Let's see how many we can possibly get. Go subscribe if you're not already. 70% of you who watch these videos are not subscribed. Please, if you do anything today, anything at all, give the video a thumbs up. Go down below, subscribe. And um, actually, if you do anything today, you should do something that makes you happy. That's what you should do. Also, actually, one more thing that you should do is check to see if you can come to mine, Zoe's and Joe's pop-up shop in London. The details are here on the screen now. Hopefully we'll see you there. We're going to be hanging out ad hoc, random times, hanging out with you guys, serving you the brand new PB Sug Life collaboration. That's about it. I'll catch you soon. Goodbye, guys.